Mega Man, you can do that uh, down B, Leaf Shield, run into them, get hit by like five hits of Leaf Shield, and then like follow it up. Whack it. Hope you guys are having a good night, by the way. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, we are pretty much in the depth of top eight. Everything here will be top eight. Um, can't wait to see who actually moves on here because um, it's going to be great. Yeah. And you know, like the weekly, right before like the big monthly tournament is oh always yeah. hype, right? Yeah. You got, uh, this is like where the best practice comes in. Um, get to see the, the killers coming into bracket this weekend. Um, yeah. So hope to see you guys this weekend. Same venue, the weekly wave, uh, Revenge of the Six. Pretty hype. La Luna Schleiss coming out. Yeah, La all Luna, the way. La Luna coming out, rocking that melee and ultimate. But here we go, stadium, game one. And oh. psych. <laughs> and no, that's it. Psych. Congratulations oh, to uh, Riddle for taking game one. <laughs> Maybe a missed tag or something like that. Yeah, probably. No? I don't like how Riddle was smiling. I feel like there was something there. It was definitely uh, kind of spaghetti. Yeah. Was it the color? Don't tell me it was the color, uh, bro. Yeah. No, the, co the color matters. You, you don't really feel at home if you're not rocking the right color. As we were saying, game one going into it. Greninja and Ripper. What do you think the game plan is here for each of these characters? Well, Greninja's mobility is insane in this game. It has really great combo tools. So you can definitely see Riddle's trying to put up that wall of projectiles like you see him at the ledge here. And uh, Greninja SD Inc. Uh, but yeah. Ooh. Greninja is definitely going to want to try to break that zone and start comboing him. Because once uh, Richter is in disadvantage, like you see him right now, it's just kind of going to keep him there for a while until he can just maintain standard stage again. Wow, nice nair into that up touch. He caught him right as he knew. Okay, I know you can't get out of this. Ooh, and again, man. Yeah, that nair is a great combo starter. Uh, it's Even also really good to keep people away from you, too. It's yeah. a good get off me tool. Yeah, you can run sure. in and nair. And, like, if they come at you and they don't stuff you with an aerial, you're going to hit them and then combo start. But this is where the trouble comes. Oh, but great. Jumping over the, the fire into the nair. Now he has stage control. Goes for the edge guard, but great early up B. The drag down. Oh, good tech, though. That could have definitely led to an up smash, but uh, the awareness from Riddles. And that whip keeping him out. Yeah, like oh. I said, Riddles uh, very proficient at his aerial game, keeping opponents out. But JW finding that F smash to close up the stock. And you know, only 80% after that early SD, uh, definitely still in it. Yeah, as long as his mentality is doing well, which I imagine it will be, because again, it sucks to lose the stock that early because of uh, yeah. either a missed buffer or um, jumping and not realizing that you jump. Okay, landing there again, but doesn't get the dash attack uh, combo starter. Oh, he shortens it. I, I was a little worried that Axe was going to hit, but great awareness. And another Again, air dodge. dude. Ah. I think I know what's happening here. It's very unfortunate. What's happening is he's getting hit by the flame. And yeah, might be he's him. holding L, and he's air dodging right yeah, away. Could be, could be. Mm -hmm. right, gets the dash attack. Good air dodge on the But catching it again. Great reactions. And that angle fair. So good. Okay. Catches him with a quick down tilt. Oh, that holy fire, uh, holy water, unfortunately getting stuck on the platform. And both players are trying to not only keep center stage, but they're trying to make the other person go to the ledge. They know that their edge guarding tools are very good against each other. Yeah. Uh, once you get Victor off stage, it's over pretty much. It's very limited in what he can do. He can either whip to tether to the edge, or he has to up to. Yeah. And I think Greninja is very good at dealing with that. Yeah, good that water there. Oh, wow, that was such a good angle on the fair to catch that ledge. But the Elfair is going to close out the stock. And JW with the composure after a double SD. Ooh, not a oh, I was worried. Dude. Okay, here comes the combos again. 38% so quick. Doesn't get the drag down. I think he was aiming for that, but he's still getting a lot of damage. And right now, Riddles needs to be very careful. He needs to keep that center stage. He does not want to go to the edge. He wants to make sure he can make Greninja go over that Hail Mary F match. Maybe hoping that he gets kind of caught by it. Yeah. Like I said, Again, once, dude. Yeah, once Greninja gets in and he's in your face, it's really hard for uh, Belmonts to kind of get them away, which is like obviously their end goal. But great stuff from JW. After two SDs and the men stayed in it. Yeah, like when you consider that he air dodged very low, like at percent, like it was like 20 and like something else like yeah. that, like ridiculous percent. Yeah, but relatively early on both stocks. But like we said, the JW, 
establishing himself as a top player early on into Ultimate in our region. So he's very kept, active. Kept he is yeah. going to every weekly pretty yeah. much. He's going on most of the monthlies, um, and it just shows. And um, while he's got results as well, he's usually top yeah. eight, yeah. top three. He's definitely in there, man. He's doing really well. Even like in Smash 4, the kid's got the hunger, right? He wants to be a top competitor, and it's showing, all right? All that, the fruit of his labor. I like how the announcer says Green Ninja. Yeah. It's very pleasing to yeah, listen to. <laughs> all right, back to stadium. I mean, there's no reason not to go back here, right? Yeah. Like, when you consider what happened. So comboing off the return of that boomerang, good stuff. All right. The combo oh game. No. So much early damage. And even, oh, I think the water? No, he still had his jump. Great. I'm great actually stuff. surprised that man should get back. I thought he was dead. Yeah, I thought maybe that back air would have caught the jump, but uh, kept it. And he was able to make it back. Okay, another down Oh my wow. god, he goes for it, the madman. Yeah, he had the read just a little too early on the punish. Okay, the, the FTL a really good get off me tool. And now he has the space that he needs to keep him at bay. But JW seems so good at breaking up that wall of defense. And He's got him. the speed and the tools to do it, yeah. yeah. Oh, the water pushing him away. Yeah. He's going to get back. It's a little short on that up B, but JW with the first time in the set with the stock advantage. And uh, see, how much, it away. Yeah. Yeah, see how much percent he can rack on. That axe, great angle. Oh, man. I think no he follow up. Though. Yeah, he had already committed to the second axe, so no follow-up. Oh my god, I, I feel like Riddle was a little bit whiffy, but he finally managed to close it out yeah. right there. And that's the, the, the frustrating part about playing Belmont. So like once they have the holy water set up at the ledge, it's, it's his game right here. Just trying to find the, the options out. You just become another common enemy in Castlevania, dog. He's just throwing his whip at you. Yeah. You gotta take it. Ooh, I love the double hit, man. Double hit also, another pleasing thing to listen to. Well, the substitute on the return, great stuff. Yeah. That goes far, man. I didn't think it went that yeah, far. And you can also pick the angles, uh, too. So it's a very versatile counter. Mm -hmm. The holy water into and S. And the smash. whip. Oh, wow. Almost killing uh, 75 after the hit. Okay, gets the dash attack. Misses the fair, but the great tech chase on the platform. I'll smash again. Yeah, Riddle's trying to mix up the landing by air dodging onto the stage, but JW with the awareness to catch him with the up smash. What do you think Riddle's does in this situation to kind of avoid that? You think he just um, he just lands only, maybe? Yeah, like, it's a little risky to continue to stay off stage because we saw how good JW is at throwing out the a beef just to get the water gimp. Uh, so it really comes down to a mix up, and JW's got to react to whatever option Riddle chooses. Right. This character's got so many angles, dude. Yeah, wow, the axe going through the stage. He gets the get up attack, but uh, get up from stage into the grab. Good stuff from Riddles. Great presence of mind to realize that uh, Holy Fire, uh, JW waited it out, but in response, what Riddles can do is walk up, grab him. There's nothing really stopping him from doing that. Yeah, JW had time to standard get up, but Riddles with the awareness for the grab. He tries to get the tech chase with the nair there, but just a little short. And I wonder how uh, Riddles will deal with JW landing from above, because right now it doesn't feel like he has an answer to that. And I know that the Belmonts don't have the greatest up tilt in the world. It is a very, very small hitbox. It does not actually not go yeah. to the sides of them, just directly it's up. Directly above, yeah. Yeah. So, like, JW could probably just kind of stay above him and not have Ooh. to worry. Catches him with the holy water, but just an F tilt. Great axe off stage. And now Riddles has slowly but surely been racking up this damage and a great lead right now. Looking real nice to close out the game three. So you can just get a good solid hit. JW's goal here is to not let that happen. He wants to get in, maybe get a grab, maybe a combo story. He doesn't quite get that fair. So. Yeah, he's going to be looking for those Nair to uh, fairs, something that closed out the game. But Riddle's evasiveness has definitely stepped up a little bit. He's Very no hard longer to hit. getting hit by these like stray uh, yeah. combo stars, like uh, down tilt, F tilt. Yeah, he's playing very, uh, very slippery right now. Oh Ooh. wow, that little whiff on the up beat. Okay, Not, doesn't eat up too hard of a punish for it though. Uh, I think he wants to nair hit recovery, which is yeah, a good idea. Yeah, he's trying to get the, the box, but it's so fast. And both of these players, a high percent of the axe, Ooh. gonna do it, bro. 
you can't quit out like that. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of those, uh, like, you saw it coming for so long, and you're just kind of upset with yourself at getting hit by it. But at that angle, not too many options, right? Yeah, I mean, like, persistence is key. He's conditioning you, and at the point where he's going to, like, okay, now I can hit you with this, and I probably have the right angle. Mm -hmm. You can't be perfect forever. Yeah. When you're perfect forever, you start winning tournaments. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he... I think he noticed that JW was opting to go low for his recovery, and mm. that axe is definitely a great tool catching that. All right, 1-1. One, one. No, that's 2-1, right? Is it 1-1? One, one? Yeah, 1-1. One, one. Uh, JW took game one on stadium, game two on stadium, goes to riddles. I think they're just trying to clarify if it's best of five. Yeah. So, uh. Yeah, it's always good to know ahead of time uh, if it's a game three situation, if you still have a game of wiggle room, you know. So I'm thinking about what the game plan is to maybe swing it into the other player's favor. Uh, Greninja is doing a great job of getting in, as you uh, pointed out. He knows that he can get in on Richter. Richter doesn't have really anything to kind of respond to that. Mm -hmm. He doesn't have a good up tilt. He doesn't have a good out of shield option. Yeah. And there is an out of shield option, but it's a very weak one. It doesn't really have a lot of uh, strength to it. Yeah, pretty it's pretty much. committal, too. If you're doing it rising out of uh, shield, you can definitely get a hard punish if JW sees it coming. Meanwhile, oh, it is a best of three. Okay, so oh, it wow. is a best of three. So this is do or die going back to stadium. Best And three. now the tension in the air is something that's yeah, a little right. more thick, essentially. And you can kind of see it. They're a scrapping man. Yeah. They they realize that this is their tournament life right now. And they definitely want to get this tournament result. They want to look good going into next weekend. Or this week coming up, rather. And you see, like like you said, he's trying to get those near added shields. He's trying to make that space get Greninja off him. And when he does have him at this range, this is where Richter wants him, right? He wants to keep him away with the fairs and the F-tilts. But JW not having it. I love the weight that Riddles does when uh, he has... Ooh! Hit him with a whip! Yeah, just up a little too high and got a little bit of charge on that F smash, killing relatively early. And then we see that Nair out of shield trying to cover his approaching flank. Yeah. He doesn't want JW to get on him. Yeah, it's not so much like an out of shield punish, but more of like an escape. Yeah. Uh, just trying to retreat or uh, move forward with the Nair. And now in a bad spot, but a great air dodge uh, into the stage. Gonna make it back. The axe. That Ooh! So close. <laughs> F-Tilt is so quick, dude. It comes out yeah. really quick. It's one of his best options for creating that space that he wants. And I'm, I'm going to be real with you. I kind of see JW playing way more aggressive. He's not kind of like baiting out Riddles anymore. And Riddles yeah. is just like realizing, okay, you're coming at me. I know you want to hit me. Ooh. I can do this. Yeah. And like that, he's got a two-stock lead. Yeah, this is a great lead right now from Riddles. Uh, maybe JW playing a little flustered because he was doing really well at uh, opening up his opponent earlier, but he just kind of seems to be running into things at this point. I like that. Yeah, he matches the job. Yeah, yeah. reads the, the short hop in neutral, just run up, up smash. It's a very strong uh, move there. Oh, what was that? All right, gets the water shuriken. No combo off it, but the up throw, here it comes. Ooh. Big damage, dude. All right, GW looking back into his zone, getting these high damage uh, strings. Oh, great parry into down tilt. That was a great punish. I rarely do, uh, see a parry actually get converted like that, and that was a solid conversion. Yeah, I think Greninja is one of the characters more susceptible to because a lot of his combo game revolves around that landing there. Uh, not telegraph, Ooh. per se, but easier move to parry than others. And I like that he's mixing up the uh, counter. He's going up because, again, I think he kind of realizes that uh, Belmont can't really go up there and hit him. They have to get the up air, which is very precise with Bob yeah, or Nair. Not a great jungle game on them, but it's a very good keep away game. Oh, he's oh, wow. crazy, dude. He's I'm crazy. with Sickle Bow with that down tilt. Yo. Oh, he does not want to get hit by that. Very dangerous position right now. The axe comes out. Oh, air no. dodge. Did miss that air dodge to the ledge. Tried to air dodge to the ledge so avoid that axe, and that's going to be the game. Is that going to be it? I believe it was a best of three that we. Uh, I I don't know. My man looks like he's getting comfortable for a game four. <laughs> yeah, yo, are we going to game four? I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> uh, I think he has to stay on for a losers match. Oh, yeah. okay. So it looks like we're going to be seeing another JW set. Or a what? 
a little bit of uh, confusion, I'd say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being trolled, man. So, is it a game five? Is, is, is it best? Of? What's going on? What's going on? I don't know. Yo, I guess the gentleman. <laughs> that gentleman hey, can I get another game for this? Can I get, <laughs> yo, I'll get two more? Bro? You'll have to be blessed. You're losing. You're like, hey, man, how about one more? Oh, boy. All right. Yeah, they're going so into like it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, spaghetti everywhere. It is best okay, of five. Yeah, all right, guys. We're good. I'm just being straight lied to. I'm being fed <laughs> false information. Yo, I trust All right. You. They got a banger on right now, though. For game four, 2-1 uh, for Riddles. All right. Now, ooh, and that's a meaty combo. He doesn't get the drag down, but that's a good 71% actually off that entire uh, straight hit. Yeah, and uh, I, I like the change of uh, scenery. You know, the platform's going to help with uh, the juggle game that JW's been also, showing off. Also, this is a straight-up banger, by the yeah. way. If you are not doing multi-man melee on Battlefield, you're messing up, dude. Yeah, you're missing You're missing out. Oh, okay, rolls passive and not enough reaction time on Riddles to punish it. I wonder if he could have down smashed it because, like, it feels like he maybe could have read that he was rolling. That's, like, thinking way in advance. Yeah. I think JW was so fast to react with the roll that uh, Riddles wasn't ready after the setup. Now, what do you do here other than go out like that? Because Ooh, great tech. Yeah. You hate to see people miss that tech and die. Like, Ooh, they catch them with the F smash on the landing. Yeah. And, uh, you know, after that very strong showing from Riddles game three, this is uh, good stuff for JW taking the lead here, keeping that composure. And, you know, already 39%. I see what JW has changed about his gameplay a little bit. He's no longer approaching with Nair and trying to get a grab. He's actually approaching with Nair at the cross up and then moving quickly. He's yeah. not committing anymore. Yeah, that's really what you gotta do. You gotta capitalize on the quick movement of Greninja uh, to find those openings. The air dodges into the axe. Speaking of openings, dude. Hey, cut him up. <laughs> yeah, cut him open real nice. He's like, yo, Laluna, dash life? All right. Gets the down tilt punish on the thing. And nice. Reed roll it. Yeah, that's good. And here comes the setup. Gets uh, the jump off the ledge. Yeah, did that guy hit him? It looked like it hit him, but it, like, it didn't do anything. Like the drag down into the tech chase. Great stuff. And here we go. The great combo game from JW that we've all known. Even oh, from last game. and he's like, yo, you going to land on me, bro? My man is woke right now. He's ready. Yo, I, I see that in Elite Smash every day, bro. You can't land on me with an aerial. <laughs> Dude, it was the sweater. It was weighing him down. He took off the sweater. My man is looking clean. Rock Lee in this. I love watching Greninja do combos. Right, Sets up the Holy Water. Great double jump into Terra to avoid that setup. And Riddles is coming down with a lot of aerials. I wonder if he's going to, like, what is he aiming for here? Is he trying to do a down air up B to get a kill confirm? Yeah, the, the down air up B definitely uh, DI'd in Ken combo. Oh, what? He catches him with an air into up area. And that's really what JW wants, right? He wants the combo starters on the approach. Great up he had a shield. Okay. Reads are trying to punish that. I feel like there's a little bit of frustration coming out in Riddles because He's trying to get a setup, he's trying to get a good hit, and he's trying to up B him. Yeah, that back throw? Yeah. Oh, he's like, get off me! Yeah. He whips him, dude. Yeah, that two-handed swing, <laughs> gonna take it. Yeah, but JW is still pretty good lead right now, 39%. It doesn't really have to worry about those openings that he had to early on, because he's kind of just in control right now. Yeah, just making space for himself to counter. He goes up! Ooh! Okay, no. my man's got the follow-ups. My man's got the follow-ups. My man, so this is no fly zone, bro. Legit. You can't fly here. My man team rocketed himself <laughs> all the way up there. That was pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Belmont could be a Pokemon villain, I could see it. Yeah. Maybe more like Simon. <laughs> you are you Simon or Richter? I'm a Richter kind of guy. My yeah. man looks fresh with the Ryu headband, you know? <laughs> yeah. I'm feeling it. He's got the fashion game on point. Simon's an old man, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, this is it. Game five. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> it's the color, bro. Yeah. My man didn't get his red Richter. Yo, he's got to get the red, man. This is where boys become men. <laughs> or maybe in Riddle's case, yeah. still a boy's becoming boy. 
Yo, this man is young, like 17, 18? What? That's where the real killers are, you know? Yeah, man. Those quick fingers. They got the quick mind, bro. <laughs> Me and you, we, 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 yeah, we got the age, man. The Me old man reaction. Three, yeah. Two, one, All right, back go. to stadium. Yo, I love the red and blue music. Let's go, yeah. man. Remix is fire. All right. Early stage control by Riddles, and you can see just how much percent he can rack up quickly by creating that wall that he wants. And, like, I get that he's going for the Efto. Efto is quick, but, like, recognize that JW is, like, shielding when he rolls in, and you could grab that. Yeah. Okay, but these players are better. Doesn't connect it, though. And now Riddles for stage control again. He runs at him, dude. I love that. I love the run. Like, you can't run through. <laughs> you run at them and yeah. you test them, dude. It doesn't get the drag down. Oh, just running full screen at him. I don't know about those up, dude. Yeah, it gets the. Oh, oh I Careful. thought we were going to see another unfortunate SD. But gets the landing down there. No conversion, though. And I'm just trying to think of how he kills the life. Ooh, no! Yeah, once you shield that, it becomes a, a neutral fire. Well, it hit both opponents. And the up out of shield, yeah. gonna kill. A little bit of assistance on the platform height. And there goes the first stock to Riddles. Okay, reads the Nair out of shield, catches him with that little lick. And I don't think Nair is a very good option in terms of like when Greninja lands with Nair, because if you try and jump out of your shield, you aren't quick enough with that frame data to actually get away from that. Yeah, the up tilt. Pretty safe on shield. And if you commit to something slow like that, like you saw, he hit him with the up tilt. He just has frame right back. He thinks he's going to go with the downer. He's yeah. reading the downer because yeah. Riddle is just coming down with it. Just got the wrong side of the downer. Oh, you get the hit? You always think the axe is going to get stuck in this stage, but that baby just keeps going. Wow. Wow. Opposite side. Barely doesn't kill there. Yeah, almost went coast to coast. Up he had a shield, no punish. Did you have a kill there? Yeah, up throw, uh, but pretty high percents. Yeah, I was about to say, there's no way that would kill there. Now? No. We not snake boys. Okay, the battle do it, yeah. There. Yo, we got the spear going, bro. Those combos, once you get those low percent, like nares and stuff, it just racks up so much damage so quick. My man is going for the hard read. JW finishes his combo and then runs like halfway to the other side yeah, and up smash it. Yeah, Riddles has been opting for that down air uh, a lot of the time, so. Oh, great parry. Nice, That's what I said, yeah. like, the way Greninja gets his combo started are those late landing aerials, right? So if you're aware of that, you get the parry in and get a punish. JW on his last weekly stock here, uh, looking at getting eliminated right now. Yeah, my man, wipe the sweat off the brow. Because he knows he's a do or die here. Oh, yo, he's never been using the side B. That was the first time I see it. Yo. Oh, no, okay. No. Oh, no. He went sick of him, yo. My boy knew he was, he was coming. Yo, he turned to the crowd like, yo, my you man, see that? My man cocked that whip back a good 30 seconds before he even up beat. Dude. I love hitting those. As a fellow F smash at the ledge, man, I love when you can like just like, yeah, this is going to hit, man. This yeah, is it. that last fair sent him at such a good angle that he couldn't really go anywhere else, right? I don't think he